10 years since my only child, Matthew, died whilst in the care of Essex Partnership University NHS Foundation Trust. And since then, there have been in excess of over 1,500 unexplained deaths and failings brought to light. 10 years of fighting to obtain any semblance of truth regarding his death and a systemic pattern of repeat failure has continued for other families. To date, there has been no accountability, no resolve, just an increase in death toll. I asked the government how many more need to die. It is fundamental that a statutory public inquiry is called and it is run in a way that reflects the needs of bereaved people and ensures public trust. We need a truthful and transparent account of what has been happening and continues to happen to prevent reoccurrence of these failings. The government's current independent inquiry review is being held behind closed doors with no statutory powers whatsoever. It's a disgrace. The latest Channel 4 Dispatches documentary, Hospital Undercover, Are Our Wards Safe?, has revealed what I and many of the families have been saying for years, that the lack of care, serious failings and deaths continue. Nothing will change without accountability. What the families need now is that one final decision to be made by government to set up a statutory public inquiry. Evidence must be disclosed under oath to bring about significant change. There are too many unanswered questions for so many families. In this country, we give our family members over to mental health care services as we want them to be professionally cared for and protected to aid their recovery. The Channel 4 undercover investigation shows that in Essex, this is clearly not happening. I stand with multiple families pleading with the government to convert the current toothless inquiry to one that has the statutory powers required to bring about the changes we need. We need and must have a statutory public inquiry now. <laughs>